guys, I'm here at my friend's farm and we're about to check out the sheep. Welcome to Reach Online. Happy to have you guys with us again this week. Look what I found, a sheep. Hey. <laughs> and a dog. Today we're talking about the parable of the lost sheep. Have you ever been lost? I asked our junior high students to tell me a story about a time that they've been lost. from Peanut Rose. What do you think? If a man owns a hundred sheep and one of them wanders away, will he not leave the 99 on the hill and go and look for that one that wandered off? And if he finds it, truly I tell you, he is happier about that one sheep than about the 99 that it did not wander off. In the same way, your father in heaven is not willing that any of these little ones should perish. So he told them this parable. Which one of you having a hundred sheep and losing one of them does not leave the 99 in the wilderness and go after the one that is lost until he is found. And when he is found, he lays him on his shoulders and rejoices. And when he has come home, he calls together his friends and his neighbors saying to them, rejoice with me, for I have found my sheep that was lost. In the story of the lost sheep, the shepherd rejoiced when he found that one sheep, more than he rejoiced that the 99 didn't go anywhere. See, Jesus, is that shepherd and he rejoices when a lost soul comes to him when a sinner comes to jesus get your best dance moves on because there's a party in heaven hey guys this is what you need to know that just like that shepherd loves his sheep jesus loves you it doesn't matter how lost you think you are. It doesn't matter how many bad things that you've done or how far you think that you've wandered away from him. Jesus loves you. He wants you back. Be sure to share this video with your junior high friends. We'll see you again next week. <laughs>